my Ms. Artastic and in this video art tutorial we're going to draw a bumblebee. So grab your favorite art making mediums and let's make some art. Teachers, don't forget that you can find all my fully planned and engaging art lessons in my TPT store. Simply search Ms. Artastic on TPT. All right, begin your bee with one circle and one oval. That's slightly smaller for the second eye. And in each one, we're gonna draw one big oval and two smaller ones for the shine of the light. And then you can go ahead and color in the dark of the eyes reading those circles white. Next, we're gonna draw the bee's head around the eyes. And then you can draw the antennae. So first we're gonna draw two dots, nice big circles, color them in, and then from each one, draw a line up and over. Then thicken up each one to make the antennae. Perfect. All right, we're gonna make this a nice little bumblebee, so draw a fuzzy little ring around the head. We're gonna draw one wing and a second one going the opposite direction for the wing on the other side. And then you can draw around that a little bumblebee body. Draw a little stinger on the end and color in most of it, leaving just a little bit of white. We're gonna draw some stripes, curving the lines with the body. Perfect. And then you can add some little bumblebee legs. So we're gonna add six legs to our bumblebee by drawing three thick segments the end being the smallest one as it's the little foot. And you can have just little legs peeking out on the other side as we won't see most of the leg because it's hidden by the body. And of course we must make them smaller so they appear to be farther away to create some depth on our artwork. Draw a line up the center of each Next, you're gonna grab your black felt marker. We're gonna go around the outside of the B, except for the antennae, and we're gonna trace around the outside, thickening up the lines, making it bold, beautiful, and professional. It's gonna give our B a nice clean look. I'm also going to avoid tracing around the, le the legs as they are much too narrow. So just around the bee's body and wings. Perfect, once you're done, you can get ready to color. I'm gonna begin with black. So I'm gonna do this first stripe black. Then we're gonna skip a stripe for the yellow stripe. Next stripe will be black. And we'll leave some white edges on there for some highlights. Okay, then I'll grab a yellow. I'm gonna start at the back. Yellow up, leaving some white edges for highlights. 
and then I'll color the remainder of my B with my yellow. I'll use a blue felt marker to go up the center of each wing to add a bit of color. And I'm also going to go along the edge of the eyes with that blue as well, along the edge of the white. And that's just gonna add a little bit of color to my bee. I'm also gonna take this blue and I'm gonna add dashed lines around my background to show the path that the bee has flown. Perfect, grab your gray felt marker. We're gonna use our gray for some shading. So take your gray, shade around the head where it overlaps the body, shade around the eyes, under the antennae, the bottom half or edge of your wings, and along the bottom of your body and face. And once you're done, your lovely be drawing is done. I'm Ms. Artastic, and that's the end of this episode. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button. And for more art lessons, 100 exclusive art lessons, make sure that you check out my course, 100 Cartoons for Kids. The link is in the description of this video, and it's 100 exclusive drawing tutorials, premium drawing tutorials for kids. You can use it as a course for at home if you're a kid. You can follow along with any medium or if you're a teacher, you can use it as your directed drawing program in your classroom for obviously an entire year because you have 100 drawing videos to choose from for your classroom. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video and comment with ideas for things that you want me to draw in future drawing tutorials. I'm always open for ideas, so comment with things that you want me to draw and let's make some art.